What's going on everyone? Got a 22 Ford Escape. We're gonna check the cabin filter today. I'm gonna show you how to get to it. It's gonna be behind your glove box. We're gonna need to lower your glove box. Okay, so the first step is going to be to disconnect this damper right here. And all we gotta do is grab it with our finger and pull it and it'll disconnect like that, okay? So now we're gonna need to push these stoppers in so the glove box will come down. Let's push on both sides. And then right here is where the cabin filter is gonna be. The two Phillips screws, you have one here and one here. We're gonna need to remove first and then we can take this door off, okay? It's just clipped on some clips that we're gonna have to push outwards to get this door off. All right, so I've got these screws nice and loose. I'm gonna go ahead and just push this tab outwards and pull the door towards me. And it is connected down here at the bottom. The door's actually not gonna come all the way off. Okay, so push our thumb. So this filter, um, probably gonna need to order one. I don't actually have a new one. Um, we're checking it today just to order one. Um, if you need one, uh, there'll be a link down in the description box for a uh, cabin filter just like this. If you wanna get one, uh, the part number, everything will be down there too. So check that out. But when you get your new one, um, just go ahead and make sure that you put it in the correct way. Okay, this one says airflow down. So make sure you do that. Just reinstalling it is very, very easy. Just clip this guy back in here like that. Okay. Now you can put these screws back in or you can leave them out. I'm gonna leave them out of this one because we're coming back in this one whenever I get the filter, okay? And then all we gotta do is just close the glove box and hold itself up. What I'm gonna do is hook the damper back up and we're all done. Well, I hope the video was helpful and if it was, I'd really appreciate it if you liked and subscribed.